and they all lived happily ever after. The end. Good night, you guys, and sweet dreams. Have a nice night. See you tomorrow. Oh! I didn't see you there. I, you just caught me in the middle of setting my stuffed animals off to sleep. Come, come. I was just about to set these little stinkers off to sleep, too. But now you are here. See, in the Harden household, we are very, very committed to making everyone happy. We respect, we play, we love, we nurture, and we take care of our pets. For now, these guys are our pets. But to have a real pet, to have a real pet would be amazing. I know. A bunny. A bunny rabbit would just do perfect. Would do so well. I think a bunny would be a perfect fit for our quaint little quiet house. Perfectly with all my little friends. To have a real to have a real animal. To just responsibility and everything. And all shapes and forms. Now, we'll go to Professor Bria for some enlightenment. Hello, my name is Professor Bria, and today's lesson is why we need a bunny. To teach responsibility. They don't make noise. It will teach us to be committed. They are cute and cuddly. It will teach us to be better people. We will prove to you that we can do it. And that's why why we... And that's why we need a bunny. So, now we're going to sing a song for you guys. <sighs> Ready, Bria? Ready, Taylor. One, two, three, and... Listen up, uh, Mom and Dad. We want a pet. One that we think will be. Listen up, guys, and listen really well. We want a bunny that would be swell. Bria wants one, too. Something we agree on. We'll share the work. Clean up what it pees on. Listen up, guys. Listen really well. 
We're begging for a bunny, and no, we're not being funny. We're serious now. Please get us a bunny. Peace.